Hi guys, welcome back to Wayward Sun Custom. Today we have a camouflage envelope. That means we have Grim Survival for July of 2022. And in case you're wondering, not only is this a very inexpensive, um, it's only $20 a month, so it's an ex inexpensive subscription, but this is also one that I usually wind up getting early. I actually, um, I actually got this a few days early, um, before it even turned July, and this is the July package. So much better than some subscription boxes, you know, like I'm not going to name any names, but it rhymes with pack tack. Um, yeah. So, you know, that are always late and, and all of that. So let's see what we have here. All right. We've got our very cool little card here letting us know what all we got and I will just go through it um, I'll go straight down and see what we got here um, first thing up is spool micro tool grim spool micro tool is a favorite around here and among everyone who uses grim gear the spool micro tool can be used for fishing line thread wire even tape if you wrap it correctly you can put multiple types of cordage, usually up to two, on your spool micro tool. You can uh, put a small piece of paracord at the bottom of the spool micro tool as a lanyard so that it can be removed and utilized as fishing line, uh, fishing lure material if you keep fishing line on it for a quick fishing kit combo when kept together with any of our fishing tools. And the MSRP is $5.89, so let's see if we can find that. Uh, let me see. Put this stuff down here. And, uh, okay. And so there you go. And like I've said before, the thing that I really like about um, Grim Survival is all of their stuff is designed to be worn or carried in an inobtrusive manner. Um, things like cards that you can put in a wallet or a pocket and they don't take up a lot of room or uh, create a lot of weight and uh, yet give you uh, useful tools and or tips and they have dog tag tools they have these that, like the spool micro tool uh, if I can get out of the glare the spool micro tool here it can uh, has a little keychain attachment there so I like, the, I like the idea of being able to um, wear small, usable tools, and you know that way it's not taking up a lot of space, but you can get some decent kit. Now, I'm not going to say that their stuff is always going to be as, uh, as robust as, you know, if you have a card that has like a little spearhead in it, of course, it's not going to be as robust as a solid freaking steel um, spearhead that's already attached to a length of wood or fiberglass or whatever, an actual spear. <clears throat> excuse me but in a pinch hey it'll do and way less way less than the spear the actual already made spear and also not take up near as much room won't be as heavy none of that stuff much easier to transport all right so the next thing we have is the roundabout eating tool all right so the roundabout eating tool. The roundabout eating tool is a fantastic little piece of any mess kit that combines an eating tool along with a bottle opener and can opener. Being one millimeter thick means it can easily uh, be easily put uh, within any mess kit or kept in the small roundabout tin included this month. And the MSRP is $14.95. So there you go. You got your fork tines, you got your bottle opener, your can opener. And uh, nice and lightweight, and again, something you can easily wear or carry or store in a bag or what a pocket, what have you. Next, we have the roundabout trapping tool. And now, this is pretty cool. It says the roundabout trapping tool comes with three sets of traps utilized with a spring device, usually a bent sapling to spring up and either set a snare or set a fishing hook depending on its usage. This tool includes three fishing hooks as well, so you can use them in tandem with your trapping tools or separately as regular fishing hooks while the trap tools are connected to snares. This is a fantastic tool to use the spool micro tool wrapped with wire and with fishing line together so it can be utilized in water and or land. 
Um, and the MSRP is 1495. And that's what she looks like right there. So again, pretty cool. Nice and lightweight, easily stored, easily carried. Uh, all right, and then we have tip cards. Tip cards for this month include how to construct the pitfall trap, as well as how to make uh, or how to take plant cuttings, turning one plant into many with no seeds. Oh, cool. All right, so next we have the roundabout tin, a small round steel container sized to fit the roundabout tools. The coin sized roundabouts also fit into the Exotac, X Reel, and other round containers. So yeah, it's a uh, little round container. And uh, does it just pop open or does it? Oh yeah, it just pops open. You don't have to screw it or unscrew it. But there you go. So all the, uh, anything that's, anything on their website that's a roundabout tool will fit in one of these containers. So, I mean, if you're, if you're used to carrying around a skull can, you're going to be used to this size and everything. So it's not going to take up any, it's roughly the size of a skull can. It's not going to take up any more room than that. And that's right. I used to have a vice or two. I don't anymore, but I used to. All right. So next we have, oh, the MSRP on the roundabout 10 is $3.95. So the pitfall trap is tip card t2 it says this tip card covers the basics of constructing the pitfall trap this trap can be constructed with nothing more than a digging stick through a shovel uh i'm sorry though a shovel is preferred and can be utilized for the smallest game up to the largest and is incredibly versatile msrp is 185 and for those of you that are going to want to give me crap saying i can't read or whatever this is incredibly tiny print see it and I normally wear reading glasses when reading stuff this small so um, I always forget to even bother with them whenever I have grim survival although I should every time all right so trapping t2 there's your pitfall trap and tells you all about them on there and the nice thing about these tip cards is again they are basically the size of a business card or whatnot, credit card. So you can easily put them in a wallet. You can put them in a pocket, um, a shirt, BDUs, pants pocket. Put them in the uh, a pocket on a bag, what have you. I mean, you can put them in an envelope. I like to keep them in a, in a separate little wallet that I just carry these in, these and survival cards. And then if you go camping or you go to a, on a road trip or whatever, and you're going through a particular country that has snakes, like you're going through Arizona or something like that, you might want to put things to, that has to do with snakes, recognition, treating snake bites, that kind of stuff. Put those in there and you can kind of preload um, and kind of guesstimate what you're, uh, you know, what you're going to eat, what you could possibly need. It's kind of like giving yourself a survival flu shot. You don't know exactly what you're going to need, but you know that there's a possibility you could use something. Same way, you don't know you're going to get the flu. You don't know what strain of the flu. You're just guessing that that flu shot's going to cover whatever strain you come in contact with. Same thing with these things. You can mix and match, or you can keep a big old Rolodex of all of them, and then you have a quick, easy reference. Um, so I dig these a lot, and they're not uh, real expensive. Buck 85 for each tip card. So you can get a, you can get ten of them, and you've only spent, you know, eighteen bucks. So not bad. Anyway, the next tip card is number F zero two F O two, how to take a plant cutting, and it says taking plant cuttings isn't just for gardening enthusiasts, but also a survival skill. Plant cuttings allow you to make multiple plants from a single mother plant that don't require you to have seeds and also grow considerably faster than seeds do. This allows you to grow an entire garden of plants from nothing more than one single mother plant. Buck 85 for this particular one. And as you can see, gives you nice illustrations and um, tells you how to do stuff in words as well. So there you have it. Um, you got 589, 14, so call it six, call it 20. 
41, 42. You get about 42, 43 dollars worth of items in this month's um, membership for July, and it costs 20 bucks a month. So again you get a uh, to me you get a lot of bang for your buck with grim survival it's one of my favorite um subscriptions because so far they haven't really let me down now am i necessarily going to use every single thing they send me no probably not but it's nice to have these tools at your disposal in case you do need them i mean again they're so small and inobtrusive i really like their dog tag uh their dog tag tools because you can hang multiples of those on a uh, single chain around your neck you can put some you can put them on a chain or a piece of paracord or whatever hang them from a bag inside or outside a bag you can um, hang them off your um, belt like a like you would a set of like janitor's keys or something like that i mean the the cards again put them in a wallet or something like that easily transported easy to keep up with um, the roundabout tools that fit in if you don't have one of those cans i'm pretty sure a skull can would would work i don't dip anymore so i'm not going to buy a can of skull just to empty it out and um i'm not gonna waste my money on that just to see if it fits but i'm pretty uh i, I did for a number of years i'm pretty familiar with the size of the can and i'm telling you those roundabouts would most likely fit in a skull can or kodiak whatever your flavor is so you know get rid of, uh, you get one done you can clean it out put your roundabout tools in there i'm just saying i like them because you can either wear them or store them very easily and uh that and that helps ensure that you'll have them in a pinch and uh you know when crap hits the fan when you really need something you generally don't have time to go looking for it it's something you're going to need it right then so anyway that's my soapbox. I love Grim Survival. If you want to check them out, you can uh, hit the link down in the description. It'll take you right there, and uh, you can get your own, or you can order a la carte. They have they have a store, um, fully stocked store. You don't have to get the subscription. You can get uh, you can get uh, just whatever items you want, or you can do both. You can pick and choose, get a la carte items, and you can get a subscription too. The world's your oyster. Pick a pearl. Um, either way, please use my link. It helps out the channel. It won't cost you anything extra. There's other links down there in the description. There's links on my affiliate page at my website, www.waywardsoncustomgun.com. And then, you know, I got all kinds of socials, Facebook, Instagram, all that kind of stuff you can check out at your leisure. Got a store where you can buy merch and stuff also on the website. If you want to contact me, you can do so by um, commenting on any one of the videos that I put out. You can also... Uh, Hit me up by email, waywardsuncustomgun at gmail.com. Please uh, subscribe, share, like, hit the bell notifications, all that good stuff. All of that helps out, Just not, not just my channel, but all 2A channels whenever you do that sort of thing for them as well. So until next time, thank you so much for uh, being part of uh, the growth of this channel. And please help me to continue to grow as we move on. And uh, yeah, just thank you for your support. Until next time, watch your six and carry on. Wayward Sun out.